No? Okay, let's continue with the story. We are going to check this once again. After the exercises. Okay, you are not listening, right? Let me just share the screen. Harry and Mike are at Mandy's house. They are playing computer games. I love computer games, says Mandy. Suddenly, there is a blackout. Oh no, says Mandy. It's okay, children, says her mom. We just have to wait. Here are some flashlights. This is boring, says Mike. I have an idea. How about telling some stories, says Harry. We can make shadows on the wall with our hands, too, says Mandy. The children are having fun. They are making shadows. Is that a horse? asks Mike. No, it isn't. It's a wolf. Oh, says Mandy. Then the lights come on again. Oh, oh no. no, say the children. Mom, can we turn off the lights, please? We want to play, says Mandy. Okay, but you have to be careful, says her mom. We don't have to play computer games every Saturday, says Mike. That's right. This way, we can have fun and save energy too, says Harry. Very good. Okay, so we have this. Uh, exercise in order to answer. Just tell me, Mandy doesn't like computer games, true or false? True. It is? False. False. True. False. A Mandy no le gusta jugar videojuegos es falso, porque la lectura dice que sí le gusta jugar videojuegos. Bueno, en este caso, computer games. Bueno, la mitad, la mitad, porque luego los odio y luego se puso a jugar con una linterna. Ajá. Mandy's mom gives the children flashlight. True. 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 Yes. Mike wants to tell stories. True or false? False. This is boring. I have an idea. How about telling some stories? Says Harry. Says Harry. Uh huh. Very good. Mandy is making the shadow of a horse on the wall. False. 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 Who's making it? It is making a one. Está haciendo un lobo. Then we have. When the lights come on, the children want to turn them off again and play. True. True. It's totally true. Very good. Anotelo por favor. Next exercise. Let's check our review. Number one. Tenemos estas palabras, no one, anything, everyone, something, and everything. There is that. ¿Cuál sería nuestra respuesta? There isn't anything in the basket. No hay nada en la canasta. There isn't anything in the basket. Number two, what could be the best word? ¿Cuál sería la mejor palabra?
What could be the best word? Chicos? No one. No one. Everyone no one. is sitting down. Todos están sentados en la número dos. Everyone is sitting down. Todos están sentados. Can you help me? There something. is something in my eye. Hay algo en mi ojo. There is something in my eye. Then we have number four. La foto número cuatro. There is in the room. There is no one, one, no one in, the, in room. the room. No hay nadie en el cuarto. He is putting. Él está poniendo. Everything. Something. Everything in, the, in his pencil case. Está poniendo en su lapicera. ¿Estamos? Copy the answer. Yes. Your name. No se les olvide escribir sus nombres, chicos, en las, en las páginas. Very good. So, let's continue with the next exercise. Entra, déjeme un segundo. Déjeme dos segundos. Don't worry. Listo. Where is the teacher? Está, está, ya lo hice. Okay, very good. Now, let's listen and have the great answers for number one, two, and three. Let me just be in the mood. Module seven, review two. Listen and circle A or B. One. Hey, Penny. I like this picture of you and your sister. Thank you. We took it last week. Penny, you really look like her, but her hair is very long. Yes, it is. Mine is short now. She's carrying a cloth bag, too. I like it. I like it, too, because it's mine. My sister always takes my bags. Two. Hey, Rita. Can you bring me my water bottle? It's on the kitchen table. There are two bottles on the kitchen table. Which one is yours? The red one. I can see two red bottles on the kitchen table, Alan. Oh, does one of the bottles have a picture of a lion on it? Yes. Is that yours? No, it isn't. Mine has nothing on it. Three. I'm hungry. I have an idea. How about making a pizza? Let's see. There's nothing in the refrigerator. And I can't see anything in the cupboard. No, wait. There's something in the cupboard. It's a packet of spaghetti. We can't make pizza with spaghetti. You're right. But look, Dad is coming back from the supermarket. Great. Now let's check the answers. Who's Penny, A or B? B. A. It is. A or B? 
The correct answer is letter B. Then we have this one is Alan's water bottle. A. 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 This. A. Or B. 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 What do the children see in the kitchen? B. A, 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 A. There is something in the cupboard in the, it is a packet of spaghetti. Okay. Now we have this exercise where we have to write. Look at the pictures and the words. Look at the pictures and the words in the box. Ask and answer with your partner. Is there anything in the glass? No, there's nothing in the glass. Okay. We are going to have some exercises in here. Okay. Please take out your notebook. Second to quarter number four. We have Saturday, July 11, 2020. Vamos a registrar lo siguiente. Age, we have a student book. Age, 80. Number one. Ejemplo con someone. Is there someone? In the house, hay alguien en la casa? And we can have an answer. Yes, there is someone in the house. Sí, sí hay alguien en la casa. Copy this down, please. Question number two. Have you seen anyone? Has visto a alguien? Have you seen anyone in the school? Has visto a alguien en la escuela? Pues la respuesta real sería no, no he ido ni a la escuela. Have you seen anyone in the school? No, I haven't. Saying anyone. No, no he visto a nadie. Okay. Then we have number three. No one. has finished the homework. ¿Quién ha terminado la tarea? No one has finished the homework. Nadie ha terminado la tarea. No one has finished the homework. Okay, number four. We have something. Do you have something to tell me? ¿Tienes algo que decirme? Do you have something to tell me? 
Yes. Do you have something to tell me? Yes. I have something to tell you. Then we have the last using anything or nothing. Have you seen anything strange these days? As we start with extraño estos días. And the answer could be, I haven't. No, I don't. I, I haven't. It could be no, yeah, of course, because we are affirming that it's no, no. I haven't seen, it could be nothing, no he visto nada. No, I haven't seen nothing. Okay. Very good. Eva Alexandra, could you please read number one? Podrías leer la número uno? Eva Alexandra. Zoe, could you please read? Podrías leer la número uno? Yes. Is there someone in the house? Yes, there is someone in the house. Thank you very much. Jaciel, number two. Jaciel, could you please read number two? ¿No está Jaciel? Yes. No te escuchamos, Jaciel. Have yeah. you seen uh, join in the school? No, I haven't, haven't seen and anyone. Young. Uh -huh. Anyone. Anyone. Very good. Excellent. Number three. Matias Armando, could you please read number three? Number three, Matias, no? Lopez Diaz, Cesar, number three. Who has finished the homework? No one has finished the homework. Very good. Number four, Ever Fernando. Ever, do you have something to tell me? Yes, I, I have something to tell you. Very good. Kevin Ernesto, number five. Have you seen mm -hmm. anything strange since? Guys, no, I have haven't stand nothing. Okay, very good. So we have in here. Have you seen anything strange these days? No, I haven't seen nothing. No he visto nada. Very good. Now we will move to this part of phonics. Your phonics. HS are page 100, page 121, página 121, chicos, page 121, espérame, yes, los espero, 121, Entonces, 
Seven, phonics. One, listen and say. Air, air. Where, there. Air, air. Hair. Chair. Air. Air. Hair. Bear. 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 Okay, let's listen again. But remember that phonics, los sonidos, pues obviamente que generan con la práctica, ¿verdad? Entonces, entre mejor pronunciamos ahorita, mejor vamos a ir progresando. Let's listen again. Module 7. Phonics. 1. Listen and say. Air. Air. Where. There. Air. Air. Hair. Chair. Air. Air. Pear. Bear. Okay. Then we have listen and chant. Then circle the words that have the ER sound. Okay. Listen. Look over there. Look over there. It's a big brown bear. A big brown bear. Where? Where? It's over there. A big brown bear is sitting on a chair and it's eating a big green pear. Okay. What are the words with the pronunciation? ¿Cuáles son las palabras con la pronunciación, chicos? Con nuestros phonemics. Bear, bear, chair, per. Okay. Mark and Pongan un gran círculo en las palabras que tenemos detectadas. There, there. Teacher, what page? Página 121. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, the first sentence that we have is about the present. We have two. Okay. Let's put the lesser point. Do you finish? Terminaron de marcar sus palabras? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Very good. Now we are going to move to the next unit, okay? We have the next unit here. Open it for you. Okay, please go back to page 81. Let me show you where am I. It's page 81. Okay, in the future, it is this page. Page 81, in the future. 
Let's check the vocabulary. Please repeat after me. Okay. Mm -hmm. yes, sir, sir. Module A. In the future. Song. One. Vocabulary. Pilot. 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 Back. Cook. 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 Teacher. 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 Hot. 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 Pan. 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 Pilot. 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 Vet. Cook. 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 Teacher. 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 Very good. Pan. 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 Very good. Now, guys, we are going to link them and match with the letter A, B, C, or D. Okay? I love English, math, and IT. I'm going to be a teacher. That's what I'm going to be in the future. In the future. Horse and snake, rabbit and cat. Come to me, bring your pet. In the future, in the future. I'm going to be a vet. In the future, in the future, I'm going to fly, I'm going to be a pilot. In the sky, in the sky. Pot and pan, fork and spoon, dinner's ready, take a look. In the future, in the future, I'm going to be a cook. Okay, we have this first paragraph it was letter el primer párrafo va con qué con qué letra segundo párrafo con qué letra va con el veterinario, así es, en este caso veterinaria. Este tercer párrafo con qué? Hey. Hey. Pilot. Hey. Pilot. Hey. Good. And the last paragraph is with hey. cook. 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 Marquen sus respuestas, por favor, chicos. Marquen sus respuestas, por favor. Okay. Marquen sus respuestas, por favor, y nos pasamos al siguiente ejercicio. I am going to be a vet in the future. Look, I'm going to be a vet in the future. Ok. El, la pronunciación o la estructura going to significa yo voy a. Ok, es como usar dos veces el Voy a ir a, ok, this is to be, going to. Mark is going to buy a car next week. Mark va a comprar un auto la semana que entra. Tenemos en afirmativo, en formas cortas y cómo los usamos. Como estamos hablando de un futuro cercano, tenemos que usar expressions que se refieran al futuro. Puede ser tomorrow, que significa mañana. Tonight, esta noche, next week, la semana que entra, month, 
next month, el mes que entra, Monday, el próximo lunes, in an hour, dentro de una hora, two hours, dentro de dos horas, in a week, dentro de una semana, or the day after tomorrow. Estas time expressions las usamos durante, durante, durante el futuro con going to. I am going to play, you are going to play, he is going to play, she is going to play. Okay? Vamos a ver los siguientes ejercicios para poder armar um, oraciones. Okay? Tenemos aquí diferentes profesiones, vet, farmer, dentist, cook, pilot, and firefighter. Ok, tenemos diferentes profesiones y diferentes nombres de chicos que tienen cada uno que ver con sus gustos. Tina is going. Escuchemos. Tina is going to be a vet in the future. Ok, la número uno con Tina está aquí. Ya la tenemos resuelta. Tina is going to be a vet in the future. Ok, vamos a ver con Ana. Y para eso necesitamos nuestra pizarra. Tomamos nuestro cuaderno, chicos, y escribimos. Saturday, 11th of July, 2020, on the student book, page 81, we have Anna. Is going to be. ¿Qué va a hacer Ana en el futuro? A pilot. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ana is going to be a pilot in the future. Lo registramos por favor en su cuaderno. Is number two. Okay. Number three. Kim. Kim is going to be a... ¿Qué va a ser Kim, chicos? Cook. Cook. A cook in the future. No, teacher, a farmer. Oh, yeah, it is. A farmer. Kim is going to be a farmer in the future. Then we have number four. Tom is going to be a... Free fire. Uh -huh. Free fighter. Así es. Se llama fire, de fuego, fire. Free fire. fighter. Tom is going to be a firefighter in the future. Okay. Kevin is going to be a um, cook. cook in the future. Then we have Jim is going to be a, a dentist in the future. Excellent. Very good. Muy bien. Copiamos las eh, oraciones, chicos. Se va a cortar la reunión y nos volvemos a conectar, por favor.